Hey guys, so it's Alistair and this is a video on how I achieve my tight curls. Yes, it is a perm and it is a home tutorial. So many of you have actually been asking for a video like this and I was just thinking, why not? So to achieve this look, you're going to need all of this equipment. So this is the perming set that I got from my local pharmacy. You can pick up a perming set from um, your local drugstore hair shop. And I think I got this for $3.99. But um, it comes with a sponge, pen papers and two bottles which is the waving lotion and neutralizer. So to protect your skin, definitely get rubber gloves. As I wanted tight natural curls, I got the smallest rods which is the 4mm rods and I got it from my local hair shop. Well, you can really find these on eBay. So you do need the plastic shower cap. Um, this is only because whilst you're waiting, you don't want the rods to be moving. So, yeah, don't let it move. <laughs> so this is the start of the process now. And I forgot to mention, you do need a bowl of water, um, whether it's warm or cold, and a comb with alongside of the end. So after sectioning it, the hair that is needed is left out first and it's better to put it in smaller sections just so that it can be more natural. So These are the permanent papers that are included in the kit. Um, it does protect your hair from heat damage from the you know process of perming. Um, but an alternative I used was kitchen tissue and just cutting it to the same size. So you damp the hair, then you wrap the perming paper, just one, around the hair. Roll from the end of the hair away from the face um, until it reaches your scalp. Then secure it in place with the rubber end on the rod and just repeat this process in rows. This is how it actually ends up looking. It's quite heavy, but it's, you know, it's all right. <laughs> this is the waving lotion that's within the perming set. And it does come with a mini sponge, just in case you miss out them little spots. So you do apply them row by row, rod by rod, just so that you can get the tight curls, you know? Once it's all nice, succulent, moist, just put the shower cap on so that the rods won't stop moving. How much? Look at my eye, my eye, my eye, my eye, the towel now, my The towel! No, 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 no! I'm sorry. So you gotta wait one to two hours depending on your hair type i know i've got thick hair so i wait two hours but if you've got thin hair recommend one hour only <laughs> the packet does only stay 30 minutes but you know it just doesn't do its job so i have to wait two hours neutralizer is applied rod by rod row by row um, and this reconditions your hair because it's just been through the burning process but before applying the neutralizer please rinse your hair out Please use a towel to cover your face when it comes to this because you know what happened with waving lotion incident. <laughs> then you have to use the shower cap again just so that the rods won't move again. <laughs> then you gotta wait again but not too long because it's just a quick little 10 minutes. This is the last step so you just have to remove the rods one by one and rinse it out again. Yeah. 
this is not the complete look because you're not looking precise, flat or prestige yet. So please stay tuned for the next video and feel free to help uh, me with any questions either through co the comments down below or my socials. So remember to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Juices!